so much fun to give someone a gift and seeing them smile and this is made with love so I'm going to turn the camera around and show you all the things that I have got so just buy like some candy some holiday cookies some tin mints some premium mini waffle bites you can buy some Starlight candy and some holiday pretzels. So the first thing we're going to start with is um, coffee bugs. You can buy these pretty expensive at either the dollar store, general store, family dollar. Um, I think they're a dollar. Yes, they're a dollar, and you get two mugs and two lids. So what I've done with this mug is I've taken some of these holiday pretzels, and I am using my little treat bag that you can buy at any um, store like Walmart has them in their uh, gift wrapping department, Dollar Tree has them, in any place like that. And I took some of the bag, not all of it, and poured it and just wrapped it up like this. Inside of here there is also a hot cocoa. And you just slide that in, tie a nice ribbon on this. You can even slide in a Starbucks gift card or any coffee house uh, gift card that you have near you. And for under $3, depending on how much you get the gift card for, you have this cute little mug with some hot cocoa inside and a little treat. This should pop up when the bag opens. You just fit everything inside. What's nice about this, the lid will just pop on itself. No, it should. There we go. And it's all inside of the mug. This one has like little Christmas trees inside of this. And then, let me take some of this stuff off so you can kind of see what I'm doing here. Let me grab some ribbon. Then to make it really cute, you can just grab your ribbon and you're going to put it at the bottom here, pull it to the top and just do a simple bow. If you don't want to slide the card, the gift card or into the cup, you can actually do a little um, card holder on the side and look how simple and cute this is. Make sure that you cut your bottom of your ribbon so it's all on the finished look. I'm just going to grab a little, a little tag, tie it around the little bow, look how cute that is for a co-worker, for a gift exchange um, for someone that you just know that they love I didn't tie it enough that they just love coffee and hot cocoa and they love their sweets so this is the perfect gift for them a little to and from tag and there we have it under three dollars you got this cute little mug and then you also have another mug to make two gifts so not a bad deal at all the next thing I'm going to show you are these cute little tower boxes that you can buy at the Dollar Tree. Um, they sell them at Walmart, they sell them at uh, Dollar, Dollar and Family in general. What you do with these is, this one we're going to do the two tower first. So you just grab some chocolate, some candy, Let's see real quick. and then what I like to do is um, get these little gift bags inside so it's not just in the box and in this case I am going to grab some of these star mix I'm going to cut this open here and I'm going to fill up my bag with some star mix 
again, super inexpensive, really thoughtful gift to give to someone. And especially if you give this to a co-worker, everybody likes some of this candy at work. So, a little bit more. Then I just take my curly ribbon, tie a nice bow around it. If you want to, you can cut the top of your bag. You just cut the top of the bag and then you just slide everything inside and put the lid on it. And you want to do the same thing in the little box. What can we put in the little box? Let's go ahead and put some little mints in the top box. Up. And I'm going to grab another little bag. One of those street bags will do perfectly fine. Put it inside and then drop your chocolates inside of the bag. You don't have to overfill it because then you won't be able to shut just a little bit. Some of these uh, gift towers will go from $19 to, I've seen them on Amazon, I've actually sent them myself on Amazon for like $24, $30. So you just do the same thing here, just add a little curly ribbon, make it festive, cut it, and add your lid. You know, what do you get to the person that has everything? Give them the gift of food. Because everybody likes to eat. So now I'm just going to take this beautiful green ribbon. I'm using what I have. I'm going to show you a little trick here. I can get it all. So, grab it from the bottom. Pull it to the top. You want to grab it from the top, go to the bottom, flip it, and twist your ribbon around at the bottom. Make it tight. And go back up. Make a knot at the top. And cut your ribbon. I'm going to make a knot first and don't tighten the second knot all the way yet. Just want to grab a little ribbon again. And stick it through the hole. Tighten up your ribbon and make a bow. These are so simple and so easy to make and it's great on the pocketbook because it saves you a lot of money making these yourself. Make sure that you fluff up that ribbon. Look how cute that is. Now just add a little gift tag as well. Ooh, I like this. I'm going to use the snowman one. Tie it around your bow. And definitely under $5, I have another little gift to give out to someone. Now let's build the bigger tower. This one has three sizes. I don't think they had a fourth one. And these are from the Dollar Tree, but you can also buy them at Walmart and Dollar and Family General has them as well. And I'm sure Target does too. So we're going to grab another one of those little treat bags. And this time at the bottom, we are going to put some of these 
um, different chocolates. This bag was actually three dollars, so we're already at six dollars. But it is a bigger power, so then you just even if they're wrapped, I'm just gonna drop them in. Like I said, I don't like to put it without wrapping it first. All of your chocolate inside. Grab your curly ribbon. These are, there we go. Tie your bow around it. Continue the same pattern as the smaller one. And then push everything inside. For the next one, we're just going to use, actually, I'm going to trade these out. I'm going to put my chocolate in the second power instead. And in the first tower, I am going, on the first box, I should say, not tower, I'm going to add some of these holiday cookies. They sell these in different varieties, depending what store that you go to. So. I'm at seven dollars now. Oh, and these smell so good. Put those in again. Tie it. Nice little bow. So if they want to take their gift out, it's already in a bag and it's in a fresh container. Then we're going to put this box on. So first one is cookies, second one are little chocolate bars, and in the first one we're going to go back to our um, Starlight candy. Or should we go with the pretzels? You know what? We're going to go with the pretzels again. Oh, it's perfect fit. We're going to put those in there and we are going to tie it up again. And I've only used half the bag, so we're at $8.50. Cut your bag, pull your ribbon to a nice bow, cut the excess ribbon off. Now if you want to do a gift card inside of these, you can too. It all depends on what, how much you want to spend. So for $8.50, we have a cute little tower, plus the ribbon and the tag, let's make it an even $10. These sell at the store for $19 to, like I said, $24 or more. We're going to do the same thing here. We're going to grab this beautiful green ribbon that I have, and we're going to flip this over. You've got to hold it tight. ribbon tie a bow if you want to save even more money you can actually make your own treats make your own cookies you can put candy canes in here whatever you want to do and there we go stay straight I'm going to tie a knot first. So you can see what I'm doing up here. So, what I do is I tie a knot on the top. And then I'll tie my second knot, but I don't go tight on it. I leave a little space. Cut your ribbon. And then add a bow. So you take your ribbon and you put it through the second knot, make sure it's even, tighten it up. These are giving you beautiful tails on your gift. And then make a cute little bow on top. So 
fluff up your ribbons make it presentable now I'm gonna go ahead and grab another tag I'm gonna try to match it this time I think this one's cute I'm just gonna grab this one it says happy holidays and I'm gonna tie it around my bow you can add some greenery to this if you want to it's all up to you but just remember the more you add to it the more money you're adding to your gift so under ten dollars we have a beautiful gift for someone for this one we all love to bake cookies during the holidays so this one is super easy and this could be a gift for an entire family if you want to especially during covid i think every family likes to bake together so we are going to make sure you get the glitter there's a lot of glitter at the bottom i'm going to go ahead and add this shred of paper the bowl was a dollar at the dollar tree if you wish you can actually add a little um christmas sticker on the bowl i decided not to do that um, you can buy these at any store. Uh, Walmart are actually 98 cents. Uh, this one was at the Family Dollar for a dollar. I'm going to add that. Next, I'm going to add some chocolate chip packs. You can buy these at any grocery store. And they don't need a lot of ingredients. That's the other big thing. And then I'm going to add one of these packs of sugar cookies in here. Um, these you can pick up at... Walmart, they also have these for like 88 cents. Um, I picked mine up at the Dollar Tree and they're Betty Crocker utensils. So I'm going to go ahead and add, add a whisk to it. I'm going to add a spatula. And I'm also going to add a few of these spoons. Not the entire set, but just a few of them. I'm going to grab the two middle ones just to add to the container. And then I'm going to add these cookie cutters. Um, these were um, free with uh, something that I bought at one time. I have not used it, so I'm going to throw them in here. But you can buy those very inexpensive. Again, Dollar Tree, Family Dollar, or Walmart. And the next item I'm going to add is I'm going to add some recipe card. But I'm not going to leave them in the package. I'm actually going to open the package and add a curly, curly ribbon around it just to give it some interest. Let me open this up. So I just put my ribbon around it and now I'm coming around to the front and I'm just gonna make a bow with my curly, rib curly ribbon. Or I'm just gonna do curly. I think curlies would be cute. And within, what, how long is my video? 30 minutes or so, 15 minutes or so. I've created all of these different inexpensive gifts that I am sure everyone will love, the ones that receive it. Curl that ribbon up. Look how cute that is. And then I'm just gonna tuck these in here like so. Now for this gift, I am actually going to use a bigger bag. Where did I put my bigger bag? You can buy these at any um, Walmart. I know Dollar Tree has them. They're just big bag. Um, let's count this real quick. About ten dollars. You got a cute baker's gift. If you want to tuck a recipe book in here or tuck some of your favorite recipes in here to give out as a gift, I think that would be really cute. So this is a big bag. What you wanna do is you wanna open it up and tuck your bowl inside, pull it around, and then you just want to gather all of, make sure there's no air in it. And then I'm just going to use a curly ribbon to tie it, and then we'll tie a bow around it. So 
Now this is a little bit too long. I'm gonna pull it up a little bit so you can see. The top of this is a little bit too long and it's kind of drooping out. So I am just gonna cut straight. And look how nice that looks. It looks so much better when you do that. Let me get another piece. I'm just gonna go ahead and again use the same ribbon because I'm using what I have. You wanna cut your ribbon. Make sure you're now if you want to make this more interesting, you can actually take one of the spoons and tuck it in the front. So I'm gonna do that. Tie it up. Make a nice make, make a nice and then I'm gonna do a bow. So simple. Okay, so now I'm going to tighten my knot. And I'm going to have that down here. And then you can. I'm going to tuck this spoon inside here, like so. And I'm going to make a bow. With this one, I am going to go ahead and add this cute little gingerbread tack. Super cute. So there you have it. A cute little Christmas cookie bowl under $10. Then we have our large tower gift with all the goodies inside for under $10. We have our medium sized tower and I think I said maybe under $5 as well. And then we have this cute mug with some hot cocoa inside and some delicious chocolate covered pretzels for under $3. So we made four different gifts in less than can't see my time on my mm, 20 minutes to give out to family and friends co-worker what about that white gift white elephant gift exchange or just a gift exchange that you pick names at your job I think these would make great gifts so come back to see me tomorrow I will have more gifts ideas for you and I hope that you enjoyed this video please like comment share and subscribe and remember I bring things home, I bring it with love, and I bring it to life. And the best part about Christmas is giving to others. Have a great day!